I'm Jeff Sabar, the Chief Home Officer. It's tool time in the home office, and we're going to show you some of the tools you can use to be more effective, productive, and have a more hands-on and do-it-yourself approach to some of the things that you come across in your home office. We're going to shine that light on the things that you need in your home office, including, for example, a flashlight. They can help you find things when you're working underneath your desk, when you're looking th for things behind your computer in the monitor, behind the CPU. It's a great little tool to have around, a good little flashlight. Some of the other things I like to have on hand, we've all seen them, the collapsible pliers. They have screwdrivers and the like that are built in, even have a little bottle opener and can opener. Screwdriver there as well. I like to keep small surgical scissors. My wife being a nurse practitioner, we often have surgical scissors. And hemostats, sometimes you have small pieces or parts that you need to work with. Hemostats are good to have around as well. I like to have an X-Acto knife for those times that I'm cutting or working with small items, need to trim something for a presentation. It's always good to have on hand as well. I have this display. This was from a bed and bath type store for toothbrushes, but I use it to hold a variety of screwdrivers that we can keep on hand. And then also the hemostats and the scissors fit right in there as well. A couple of the things I like to keep on hand close by. I keep an extension cord wrapped up with a Velcro tie and then a power strip that folds right back into itself. This one is from Monster and it folds up neat and tidy. I can even take it on the road. Some of the things we keep close at hand as well, again, a bigger set of needle nose pliers, a whole array of screwdrivers, and then one of the things I keep on hand also. This, if you're not familiar with it, is a dust brush for dusting your monitor and keeping things clean there on your monitor as well. And it folds back in and it's good to go, usually. There we go. Now the other thing about tools is having a home for all your tools, like we said. Keep that close at hand. The flashlight goes right there, as does the pliers. Fold them up, they clamp down very easily. They tuck away, go up there. Then you push that back into place. Those have a home elsewhere. The key to your home office is having the right tools to work to get the job done that you need. With simple tools, you probably have them around the house anywhere, you can do anything you need, work on your computer, work on the electronics, even when the kids come in and need to put a battery into one of their little toys, you have it all close at hand, don't even need to leave the home office. One other thing to keep in mind, it's always good to have a little tape measure on hand. This one is from the Chief Home Officer. I'm Jeff Sabar. And we're here from the Chief Home Officer. Thanks for stopping by.